Hello guys and welcome to another episode of our cohort campaign here in Crusader Kings 2 with the Game of Thrones mod. So we're back here in the line of Deus Goat and uh, things are changing, you know, the Dothraki have reunited but so far they have not done anything to us. They haven't even finished uniting all of the lands, although maybe they are doing that or... well it's hard to say. Um, they have conquered Ibn though, so poor Ibn I guess. Um, also, there has been developments elsewhere in the world. Tolos has united almost all of northern Valeria. Only the city on the island of Valeria remains. Uh, so that's a thing. Uh, Valentis collapsed a couple of episodes ago, so that's nothing new. Uh, the Iron Throne is as close to being truly united as it has been in a while. However, uh, the rulers are the incarnate or the most mud blood house I've ever seen, House Kenning, and the heirs are the up jumped fucking lowborn filth that are known as the Tyrells. So uh, yeah, there is uh, there is uh, bad times here in Westeros. Uh, Dorne remains independent. They you know they proclaimed their independence during the War of the Five Kings, and they have remained independent ever since. The North has also gained their independence, however, they're ruled by House Mullen, which is ju it's just a meme house, I don't know what's up with that. The Starks remain, though, rulers of the uh, Stone Shore with their claim. I think I think the Starks will always have a claim on the North. Um, not entirely sure about that, though. It's, yeah, yeah, it is a strong claim. I think, I think all houses that are sort of the default houses to rule a certain province will... Uh, sorry for that Discord sound. I don't know if that actually recorded, but uh, yeah, I think all sort of basic houses, uh, like, I don't know, are the Baratheons? The Baratheons might have actually gone extinct. Connington still lives though, that's kind of neat. But uh, I see no Baratheons anymore. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, I th let's see, don't we have some Targaryens hanging out at our court? I guess I can just search for them. Uh, search all Targar, yes, no, I mean, Sir Court, yeah, so here are Targaryen courtiers. Uh, Zuppo, hello, who are you? Are you new? Uh, ah, Joria finally did some breeding, excellent, Jesus Christ, took you long enough. I'll give you some ca cash reward for that. Also, to try and convince her not to leave my court, that would be great as well. Shit, such, such, such a shame that I didn't get to name him though. Uh, also, I have been uh, reading people, well, not in the comment section, well, I have been reading the comment section as well, of course, but uh, also someone told me on the Discord to try and start some sort of eugenics program with the Targaryens, to try and breed back in um, Valerian features into the bloodline here, which I definitely should be doing. Honestly, that's definitely a priority. At this point, we're just trying to keep the bloodline alive, so there's no reason why I wouldn't be able to do a little bit of eugenics, you know? Uh, of course, the problem is they keep leaving and returning, and they keep, you know, the Targaryens are destined to be the rulers of the Iron Throne, and so they don't, they don't sit very contently in my court, um, which is a problem. But hey, at least we have a new prince now. He looks healthy enough, so hopefully he will keep it going. Uh, yeah, his parents are getting quite old, so that was pretty lucky. There's still the hope that uh, Varane, that Targaryen, will squeeze out another kid. Uh, well, she hasn't squeezed out anyone yet, so, I mean, get going, mate. Or Do you English speakers have a, an, a, like an equal word? Like, if you want to call someone a mate, what's that? What's the equivalent when the person in question is a girl? Meh, oh, I can't come up with anything. But yeah, we're, I mean, I'm really hoping she will give us uh, some kid. Uh, because uh, she's married to our son, so we're gonna try and... <laughs> influence the Targaryen bloodline with our own mud blood ways, but hey, uh, we're not playing it. We're, we're, we're kind of playing a mud blood campaign in this one, so it, it makes sense. <clears throat> Anyways, um, in the previous episode, we got our Noi back as well as Sarah Roy, and uh, we're going to be continuing to annoy the um, the Roynar because the Roynar are just annoying. They had that revolt, and uh, never again, man. Never again will I tolerate such a thing. Of course, if, of course, the game. Yeah, it doesn't really matter whether or not I tolerate a thing or not. It matters whether or not um, the <laughs> the strength of the plot is 
good enough. Are you trying to... No, don't kill my... Yeah, okay, we're already asking him to end the plot. Yeah, don't kill my heir. Honestly, you, you might just be the heir at some point anyways. So I don't understand why you're trying to murder people. Like, this is unfair, my son. Oh, no, that's not my son, that's my brother. Okay. Still, though, yeah, I'm tempted to make him my heir. Then again... Okay, so he's the commander. But it is a castle, so I'm not sure how that works, actually. Shouldn't you just be like a normal fuel person since you own a castle? Or I guess since it's a subholding, that's not how that works. His stats aren't that great though actually, so I don't know. His son though, ooh yes. Ah, he's gay though. But uh, also why are you? yeah. Uh right, right, yeah, I'm trying to sneak this guy into my house somehow. Uh, because he if he's not actually the heir to uh his father because of the whole military command thing. I'm trying to get this guy to join my court. Are you in my court, actually? Can I ask you to do that? Propose for a tour. Yeah, it says he is. Let's see. Yeah, sorry for the Discord again. Is my little brother post? Yeah, uh, me and my little brother enjoy posting uh, Ben Swolo memes uh, to each other and just memes in general. And it might be the others as well. I don't know. Uh, let's see, are you there, my, uh, my, my dude? Yes, okay, so he's in my court, excellent. Yeah, I, I, I couldn't invite him, so I, uh, did a little bit of wincest and <laughs> married him to my daughter. You know, you know, it's not quite there, but, um, she is attractive and has very good stats. So, I'm hoping he will just breed, because I might just make him my heir at some point. Actually, could I, could I do that right now? It's not an optimal time to do it, actually. I mean, I do... Well, I probably have enough money to pay my way in order to do it, but I really want to kill this guy, actually. Actually, I actually have... Okay, let's... Let's see, are we... Yeah, you know what? Uh, that's actually a priority. Unless you're... Like, how old is your ear? He's 22. Yeah, okay, we, we're doing that then. Yeah, we need to kill this guy off so that we can um, get that gay dude as the heir instead. Because um, he will last a lot longer. So, uh, you know, that will be good. That will be very good. Uh, oh, fuck you. Okay, it's just 2000. Jesus Christ. Last time these type of revolts happened, they were, they were like a million. So, you know. Well, not a million, but still 14,000. That's, that's, not, that's not a joke, you know. That's pretty serial. Um, I know serial is a dead meme, but um, what is dead may never die. Except memes, I guess. But, uh, you know. Oh. I just heard someone die. Ah! No! <laughs> Fuck! No! Right, yeah, so Lord Jakaro um, was killed by the Dothraki. God damn it, he got captured during one of those raids. Shit! Oh well. I guess we have a daughter lying around. Ah, she's. Fucking hell, she's widowed. Seriously, I, I'm the father. Like, I why? Like, it's not your choice who you marry. I am the patriarch here. This is this is patriarchy. This is like anti-feminism. I don't care if you're widowed or not. You need to marry and uh, give me alliances. No, I don't owe you anything. I have not owed you anything for 40 years now, or however long. Well, maybe not that long, but still, like, you get the idea. Um, there's this. Oh, look at that sun. Man, I want you to marry my daughters, but I don't have any daughters lying around right now. Uh, Alright, we're gonna have to wait for our daughter, or... Was it our daughter? No, not her. Um, yeah, this one, right? Yeah, this one. Yeah, so she will have to stop being widowed, and we'll try and marry it. Well, actually... <coughs> Sweetwater isn't actually that powerful anymore. Yeah, it's Andalos. That this is where it's at. Although a lot of their troops are event spawned, actually, so they will only be temporarily strong. And this guy actually just married, so that's a shame. He was unmarried by the end of the previous episode, so I don't know. Sweetwater might be the sort of more permanent um, bro, if you will. I mean, hopefully he finishes conquering Bravos. I'm getting a bit sick of these two random republics, but um, I don't know. What? I got busted? No. Does that mean it's the plot is done, or are we still hard at work? It looks like we're still trying, although now he might just go into hiding, which would of course be problematic. Uh, I don't know. We'll we'll keep going. Um, you know, a bit a bit of dishonor is uh, 
That's fine. Have some money, friend, and join my plot. Also, the rebellion is done, so that's nice. Although, he might have burnt down my darn trade post, though. Because, of course, he has. Uh, execute, or... Uh, no, I can't sell him. That's that's so lame. Why can't you sell rebels into slavery? That's like... Wh why on earth would that give you tyranny? That makes no sense. It's ridiculous. Like, why is killing... Well, I can, well, I can see from a certain perspective that slavery is... Uh, or that death is preferable to slavery, but... Mm, I mean... Still, I, st I don't see why I would get uh, tyranny for it. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll sacrifice him to the goat, obviously. I mean... That is why the black goat uh, created peasant rebels. It's so that he can have a ready source of blood sacrifice. Why else would you make peasants, honestly? Excuse me? Right, so I, I, I wanted to get treatment for my gonorrhea. But uh, instead she just chopped off my dick for no reason. Wait, wait. Or did... Did, did you? Yeah, yeah, she did. My dick. No, why would you do that? <laughs> That's not kind. What the hell, dude? Here I buy a, a shadow binder from a shy to try and heal my ass and she just goes ahead and like, oh, I'm just going to chop off your dick. I don't know. I don't know how disease works. <laughs> Fucking hell, dude. Now, I guess it is a very a shy thing to chop off dicks. Actually, was the person who chopped off Varys dick a shy? It might not actually have been pointed out that at some point. Do we want this guy's award? Yeah, I can... Yeah, actually, what, what the person I want as a ward is this... Oh, never mind, we're already taking him as a ward. Yeah, but we'll take this guy as well. Yeah, yeah, I don't care about that. Uh, okay. What the fuck? So this guy is trying to kill me, and I can't ask him to stop it. What do you, what do you mean I can't ask you to stop it? In prison, then? Yeah, well, I mean, I... I'm not gonna let you kill me. Like I like you and all, but like fuck off, dude. What the hell? Stop plot. Or did that just automatically stop it? It did. Good. Also, Morse, can you fuck off? No, you don't like me very much. Well, fuck you then. All right. Uh, yeah, let's see. Maybe the guy can pay his way out of prison. That would be a compensation for literally trying to murder me. No. Are you poor or something? Ah, oh, he's poor. Oh well, let's have him hang out in prison a while then. I'll be merciful though. Um, for once in the history of the world. Sunstone is under attack from the Stepstone. No, why would I? Once again, why would I? Alright, so let's try and kill this guy again. To secure the succession. Uh, Reluquo. Yes, yeah, so we have some nice people. Ah, oh, fuck off! Plot is revealed again. Oh, we're trying again? <laughs> yeah, you know, is, we're already dishonorable, so what the hell. Go for it, man. Hey, we killed him. Aww. So sad. Not. Uh, yeah, let's put, let's fill our council with loyalists. We might actually be able to do another... Yeah, we can totally do some more reforms here. Uh, no, we can't. Uh, can we? No, we can't. Two years. And then I can change this dumbass tax thing. Maybe even bump up this section. No. No, I don't see any good reason to do higher realm authority. Um, mainly because it's um, like we, we are just a kingdom. So we don't have to deal with the mega war system. Uh, if I ever become an empire, I'll definitely go absolute. Uh, to cancel out the mega war system. Oh, fuck off. Do you have to get fuzzy? Well, let's lose some prestige then. Are you still fuzzy? Well, there you are then. Uh, also, can I just point out that we started with like minus 1000 prestige, but we're now all the way up to like 1500. If, if we had proper traits, we could totally like invade. Actually, wasn't there a thing we could do to like to get the traits we wanted? No, I forget. Wasn't it like... Yeah, well, let's see, do we have slaves? I remember how this works. Uh, slave. 
We have... We do have slaves, yes. Um, Ismira Paramore. Well, we can set this one aside. She's a bit old now. So we will... How do I... Yeah, set concubine aside. But we need a male slave to breed her with. And uh, preferably someone she doesn't like and she's not interested in actually breeding with, you know? Uh, let's see... No, I don't know. It's not super important, honestly, who we buy. I guess it needs to be a male. Presumably males will be cheaper than females. I hope, anyways. Um, I guess we'll sort them by age. Yeah, I normally do this off-screen, but we're not going to do that this time. Uh, a joke was nine. No, he's a former slave. I hate that. Like, I hate that when you Google slave, it also brings up the former slaves. It's like, I wish I could, I, I just want slaves. I don't want slave owners. I don't want former slaves. Here's a beautiful wildling. Well, she's, well, she might squeeze out another baby. There's a chance. Um, but preferably, I just want someone cheap. Could do this Dothraki, dude. He's wounded. Uh, that's actually bad merchandise. This guy, though, Jogos Nye. He's out of diplomatic range. Well, why on earth are you showing him? I guess maybe there's a thing for that. Diplo range, yes. And then we'll try that again. <clears throat> Here's a dude, a craven. That might do. It's good, good marsh or good, um, good command as well. Actually, that could be, that could be useful. Just buy him, or not. See, I wish there was an option to like only show me slaves that are actually like purchasable. Not a beautiful one. I can't be bothered to pay for that. They're either beautiful or they are, uh, and s or uh, they're either they're either beautiful or they're eunuchs. Yeah, there's a lot of beautiful slaves out there. I think the event that spawns them from your camps, uh, there's a higher chance of them being uh, beautiful. Yeah, now you see why I do this off screen. Uh, oh, I guess there's this Jogos Knight dude. Let's bump by him. Alright, so it looks like he accepts, but yeah, 40 gold, that's fair. Uh, that's uh, okay. I would have preferred 15, of course, but yeah. Uh, so we're going to breed you with this girl. What? Age less than 40? That's a thing? Oh, fuck you, game. Fine, the other one then. Can't be. It's not a concubine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Um, right then, Ishmira, set aside. We're a bit too old to breed, right? Well, we're not technically too old, I don't think, but you know. Right then, breed you with him, and then hope that they refuse. I command you. Ah, fire! She just, she just, she just, they just, oh. Ah, never mind, here we go. Uh, never! You'll have to beat me to death! Oh, I will beat you to death! That's the point of this! Ah, She actually accepted? That's a shame. I was hoping she was going to force me to do it again, because if I, I remember... Um, if she forces you to do it again, then uh, there's a chance you can become ruthless. And being ruthless is one of the traits that allow you to invade your neighbors. But, uh, oh, doing this again. Yeah, this is, like, I, I, I need, like, automatic uh, Dothraki killing at this point, you know. Because this shit is getting old. Alright, so my game just crashed. Uh, so we lost some progress, although not too much. Although, I mean, <laughs> only really my breeding program efforts. Um, so that's unfortunate. Um, I mean, not that I've done much in this episode anyways. And that breeding program was a failure, so yeah, here comes this person asking me to do the thing again, and we're not going to do that, even in this alternate universe. Uh, yeah. Oh, fuck you! Right, so that guy we killed in the alternate universe, he is still alive now. <sighs> but of course, of course it managed to save the fact that I have no penis anymore. So, thanks game. That's pretty good. Tibero Karit has grown up. He has very yellow hair, which is, uh, yeah, I guess they inherited from his Tairoshi mother. Seems to be a bit of a tradition in that side of the family, but uh, yeah. Quite a, quite a decent character. 
shit uh, stewardship, but you know that happens. He's content though, so he might actually do for a really well, a really good vassal. And he has none of those other crucial traits. I think I'll still go for this dude, even if he's a bit gay. His brother can breed for him. That's um, that's how that can work. Yeah, I'm thinking more and more of making this. Hey, look at that! He even just, you know, gay or not gay, he made himself a kid. Excellent. Zorana. Yay, children. Not even sickly. Excellent. Oh. Hey, advanced colony. So, that's pretty fast. Pretty fast. Actually, speaking of pretty fast, uh, why am I not overseeing construction there? Which we definitely need to do. Speed that thing up a bit. Aha! City of Nelos. We have a claim on it. Bloody excellent. Um... Yeah, you're still a vassal of the Royanar, so do we... Presumably we have a truce with him. Yeah, we do. So let's chill with that. Uh, yeah, five years. Hopefully we can stick it out that long. Oh, really? Sireno Karit has gotten food poisoning. And I just... Kind of expelled my... Uh, <laughs> my... Um, Shadowbinder person. But she was awful. She just cut off my dick and then I... She dishonored me in some way. I didn't really pay attention. Uh, yeah, sure, you can... I mean, she hates me, though, so it's not like anything I'll I'll be able to do is going to really change this. Forbidden or foreign religion, dishonorable, attraction to eunuch. Yeah, no, she's merely doing her job. I mean, literally, she is. Ah! Isn't this, like, the third time we've tried to murder this guy? Come on! I've, like, bribed half the nation to join the plot at this point, like... Kill him! Mm, failure! How? Teach him about kindness, yes. Or nothing, I guess. Fuck it, hell. Now my vassals are allying with each other. This is not good. Plot is revealed. Right, so are you hard at work plotting against me? Can I imprison you now? Or was that... Are you not the one being naughty? Uh, well, you're being annoying, so you can just fuck off. But, yeah, I, I've intentionally turned off auto-stop plot, because I'm hoping that, um... What is this, Kinslay? Stop Kinslay! No, 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 that's not how that works. But yeah, I'm, I'm hoping that this, uh, dipshit of a, uh, yeah, this guy will... I, I'm hoping he will, uh, try and kill me, so that I can imprison him, in, or fight a war, or something, just... Ah, kill him! Jesus Christ! Look at the amount of money I have to invest in order to win the election. It's crazy. And I'm barely winning at that. Uh, I don't want to have to spend that much money. This is insane. This guy needs to die so badly. Okay. We died. We died of gonorrhea. Well, we, lo we lived a long time. Fuck. Okay, well, I mean, we did win the election. But I did pay like a million money to pull it off, and now I have to pay even more to regain the election. Uh. Alright then, Magister Torodos of Kohor, if he... I don't think he's named after anyone. Dynastic Stain, yeah. Our predecessor was a bit of a cunt. Speaking of being a cunt, uh, sorry uncle, you can... Ah, fuck it, I guess he deserves a funeral. Fine. Pick ambition. Have a son. Let's go for that. Our wife. Yeah, she can do. Uh, yeah, no, we have we have people there. We have a brother that I might want to inherit, or allow to inherit. But, um... Let's see, can we... Well, I guess that is the family beard. Then again, it's not the blue beard. It's not the family beard if it's not blue, so we're gonna have to go for something else, like this, I guess. Yeah, let's show off our yellow fucking hair. I wish I could change that, change the color, I mean. Because I know the Tyrushi have other types of color than just that, so... Yeah. Alright then, factions. Yeah, we're probably gonna be in for a period of instability now. Uh, okay, so even this guy actually does not hate me that much. I'm still gonna try and murder him. Because he's too old, too rich, he's just... no. Just... he needs to go away. Oh shit, we can't actually hold all of this domain. That is... 
rather unfortunate actually. And now I have to pay for this dumbass claim again. Yeah, that's annoying. Ugh, yeah, I am not very efficient when it comes to spending my money properly, I don't think. Oh, think. I mean, I know. I'm not, I know I'm not very efficient at it. Um, let's see, sort everything out again. You, I guess, can be that State Inquisitor. Who cares? Just give it out to loyal men, or men that I hope can be loyal. Designated heir. We could just do the old guy, uh, I think, for now, so that I don't have to pay that much money in order to get him elected. Because uh, I need my money. I need my money. Core physician. That's this guy who kind of likes me, actually. Discontent council. Yeah. Classic one, that. Uh, see, I don't see why you would plot against me. You like me, surely. Stop plotting, mate. Be my friend. And all my plots. What do you mean? Oh, really? You... <sighs> So that debt is still going? Alright then, five years, five, okay. Yeah, okay, five years, we can do it. Five years. Determined by memes, that's fine. Invitation, yes. And my dear, oh, natural death. Well, there you are. Uh, you, I don't know, just find yourself some high stewardship person. Non-aggression pact with someone, that's, yeah, stutter. I don't know, is that a genetic thing? Maybe we go for this one then. Nice little tie rush here. Have fun. Um, imprisonment. We can imprison this guy. You're Lord of. What exactly? That place? No, I have nothing against you. So just stop plotting. If you would be so kind. Oh, you're not gonna do that. Oh, I guess we're already. Oh, no. Will not accept. Okay then. I'm gonna put auto stop plot on anyways, just to see if we can convince some people. I think that'll be the end of the episode though. So we're 25 years old, a pretty good age for a merchant republic, uh, even if it was piss expensive. Uh, but yeah, we maintained control and now we're gonna save up for... Save up our cash, get a thousand ducats and try and pay that debt so that we will finally be back in... In good relations with the Iron Bank. Um, that would be nice. Real court physician, we don't need that, we already have one. Admired air, we're working on it. Yeah, thanks so much for watching, and until next time, bye.